Hi, this is Jennifer from Massage Magazine, and I'm here with Deborah Persinger from the Federation of State Massage Therapy Boards. How are you today? I'm well, thank you. Great. Now, tell us about what's going on in the Federation of State Massage Therapy Boards and what's new to come. Gosh, there's a lot. The um, Massage and Bodywork Licensing Exam was launched a couple of years ago, and our candidate numbers are continuing to grow. Uh, here in Florida, Florida is our number one stream of candidates, and it's been well received in the state in particular. Um, we were excited last week in July actually to launch the Emblex in Spanish. So we'll be able to serve a lot more constituents. We developed that for our member board in Puerto Rico. Um, but the rest of the country will be able to utilize the Spanish Emblex if they choose. Uh, coming up, we have two things in parallel. We have a study guide for the massage and bodywork licensing exam that we're preparing in the final stages. Originally written for instructors, but we've decided to amalgamate that to include the candidates as well. And then also we're uh, soon to launch some online practice exams to prepare people for the Amblex and give them the authentic Amblex experience without the anxiety of it being the real Amblex. So. Sounds like there's a lot going on in the future here. Going on. There is a lot going on. We're delighted. So. Great. Yeah. Now, what is the feedback you've received so far about the MLEX exam from people who have taken it? We've had a lot of positive feedback, um, a lot of gratitude for the MBLEX. It's an entry level exam allowing people to come out and practice. Um, it's written at a fifth grade reading level. Uh, it's very simple. There's a lot of good feedback that we get. Um, there are no trick questions. It's really based on practice. There's not a lot of minute detail or theory. It's really based on what the profession told us they do in practice. So it's very much practice oriented, which has been appreciated by the educators and the students themselves. Wonderful. Yeah. Now, for our readers who want more information about the FSMTV and the MLEX exam, where can they go? Uh, probably number one stop would be our website, www.fsmtv.org. Uh, we also have toll-free numbers, but you can get all that information on our website also. So, yeah. Thank you so much, Deborah. You're welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks.